Hi, my name is Mark Kivuva. I'm 22 years old and I'm a multimedia journalist from Nairobi, Kenya. I have a bias for human interest stories. I love and enjoy telling human interest stories. So let me give you a brief background about myself. I grew up in Nairobi, Kenya. I've lived in Nairobi for my entire lifetime, basically. And I do hold a degree in communication studies from St. Paul's University, where I majored in mass communication and took up a minor in film studies. Now, my journey in storytelling started out when I was a young man. When I was around 12, 11, 12 years old, my friends and I used to do this. To us, this was a camera and we used to replicate what we saw journalists do on the field. Yeah? So one person would uh, be the camera operator, the other one would be in front of the camera reporting. And little did I know that this was going to be the career I was going to take up full time as a multimedia journalist. Now, my parents noticed my passion for storytelling from the time I was a young man. And around that same period, uh, my Christmas gift for that year was a small Fujifilm camera. Uh, however, my journey in photojournalism didn't go as well as I had anticipated, but my knack for reporting grew and grew and grew further. Now, after graduating in October 2020, I joined the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation as a freelance journalist where I was able to report on stories, I was able to produce stories, I was able to direct live studio productions, among other duties which um, I was given there. This story right here is the most stressful story I have ever done. Why? It is a piece on art and how it has been used to criticize and call out the rot in the country, to call out draft, to call out politicians, to call out the Kenyan electorate. Uh, but I went through a lot of bureaucracy when I was trying to get approval to do this story. My story was edited. I couldn't recognize my story anymore. Um, a lot of things were censored uh, in that piece because uh, this is a government station. So a lot of things were omitted in that piece. One of the reasons why I want to join CGT and the Media Challengers is because international press corps enjoy a great deal of editorial independence, which is something we don't see in the local media here in Kenya. And it's something I would like to be part of and enjoy and experience it. Another reason why I want to join the Media Challengers is the fact that I want to tell great African human interest pieces from an African perspective to the global audience. I want to be able to communicate this to uh, the people out there. Many a times we usually sideline great stories from the African continent and tend to pick on the negatives. I would like to change this and I do hope to make the cut and grow into a full-time storyteller with CGTN and even anchor the news one day. Thank you so much.